You said that this is a debate that you expect is going to go on for hours. But I know that you're manifestly in favor and you are going to campaign for NATO. So the obvious question is, why now? Well, we all know what happened in 24th of February, and that changed everything. We have a ha had very strong line in Finnish foreign and security policy, policy, but now it's changed. It's totally changed. Our neighbor, has it changed? Well, maybe there has been signs for it already, but I think now, Finland, it's time to make another decision and show our way and our new decisions. And this decision, your Prime Minister Sanna Marin said, we need to make it in weeks. This is not months. We need to do it quickly. Do you expect to see a big majority here? And ultimately, I guess the question is, are you going to be in a position to apply by June that is seen as a deadline? I think there is already quite big majority. As we see in the polls, the Finns have changed their views and their ideas totally what they have thought before about NATO. And so it's at the parliament. But now we need a process. We have to take care about hearings and listening different uh, officers and people what, who are working with NATO issues and also security policy issues. So that's why today this is a very meaningful debate to start with and to take this issue to different committees. And uh, the government has made it clear they want this done by June when there's a very important NATO summit that's expected to happen. But I wonder, uh, you say the public perception has changed. You share a major border with uh, Russia. You have a complicated history with, with Russia in the past. Do you fear perhaps that Russia could retaliate if you put forward this nomination? The Russians are saying for us it could be a problem. Well, we all know what Russia thinks about NATO. And we we will take care we will uh, take care of it or but we don't let that to make any difference to our decisions. We make our own decisions here, our from our own perspective, and what we think what is best for the Finns and the security of the whole Nordic. And what you say now in this white paper also was presented last week is that essentially you now name Russia as your biggest issue when it comes to foreign policy and, and security. So the question is, is this your biggest threat? Do you look at Russia and actually now see a dangerous neighbor? Well, we don't, I think we don't have to th think about different, oh, Russia is only threats. We have every kind of threats that now we have to talk about and how this situation in Ukraine affects whole Europe. And that's why we have to all, all also think what's Nordic countries, what the Europe countries, and how will this change the architecture of the security policy. So uh, I hope, because the report is quite short actually, I hope we will have a good uh, hearings in the committees with different perspectives. But we, we, I think still we have to be quite fast.